Mobility is essential in modern warfare. In earlier times, the horse was sufficient, but has now been replaced with a variety of war machines designed for rapid delivery of combat forces and an unparalleled amount of firepower. This episode of Arsenal provides an up-close look at today's fast-moving and lethal winged cavalry. In the past, the cavalry's mobility allowed it to range deep in the enemy's rear area, attacking where least expected. With the advent of the aircraft, a new means had arisen to perform this mission. Paratroopers have become one of the key rapid reaction forces to replace traditional cavalry. In the post-war years, the technology of troop insertion began to change with the advent of the helicopter. Instead of parachutes or gliders, helicopters could now deliver forces deep behind enemy lines. Combat helicopters are often part of the Army rather than the Air Force. This close connection between the helicopters and the ground forces make them particularly well suited to carry out treacherous cavalry missions. The 1980s saw the deployment of the first attack helicopter designed from the outset for the anti-tank role. This was the AH-64 Apache. The Apache was designed to fight and survive on the modern battlefield. A new generation of missiles, missile guidance, and advanced sensors gave the Apache unprecedented long-range firepower 